Welcome to episode 38. We have Death Claws, Lunchboxes, Quests, Exploding Mr. Handies, and lots of other things as well as we move through this episode. This episode is going to be about 25 minutes long, uh, combines two different play sessions, and of course we are starting as we always start which is collect all of those skills. So let's get all of those skills and resources collected and then get on with the episode. So it doesn't look like, oh no, tell a lie, we do. I was about to say it doesn't look like we have any max skills this time, but uh, that chap in the strength room at the top, or gal, it's a gal, I think, uh, is on maximum strength. So Julia Johnson, you need to move into a different room. And of course, as well in this episode, we will have Vault Expansion. Uh, now, we're trying to work out here if there are three or four people in any of the other rooms. Uh, I don't actually know where I just dragged her to, uh, to be completely honest. Uh, let's pick her back up again and make sure she's heading to the uh, school so that she can do intelligence. Oh, and here comes Bottle and Cappy as well. Okay, so she's brought back all of her stuff, and we need to... Oh, we've got a incendiary, an enhanced, an improved institute pistol, a comedian outfit. My goodness, lots and lots of outfit recipes. Now again, we need more storage, uh, because we can't currently get the person, uh, our quest squad, back in. Uh, so we are going to need to either upgrade... Uh, that's going to be plus 45 if we upgrade it, so let's upgrade it to a depot. There we go, and it is now done, so we should be able to collect the quest items, yes we can. So an enhanced sniper rifle blueprint, an excited institute pistol, an armor piercing BB gun, lifeguard outfit, scoped pipe pistol, my goodness how many recipes are we getting. And we've collected 18 weapons, and we have got a lunchbox. So this episode, as I said, is a little bit of a frenzy. Uh, we've got a lot of everything going on. Uh, we've got a couple of dwellers to bring in from the wasteland. Our population is over 100. We are at 104. Here comes a death claw attack. And later on, we will be building the nuke cola plant. Now, I've tried to grab all of them and drag them in. Hopefully, they will get their asses back into the room before they bust through the door uh, let's see how likely that is and we're too late or are we not no no yep we are we are too late oh fantastic right let's try and get them into the storage room instead there's one of them where are the others well let's just click on him for some caps oh, trying to find your quest squad once they're in the vault they're like hey, hey we like to go and hide so it's impossible to find us Okay, let's drag that person over. There we go. That should be two people heading, and there is a third somewhere. There they are down there. Let's drag them up and put them into the storage facility as well. Now, I have no idea if any of them are going to make it in time. Uh, yes, I think they will, actually. Yep, we've got at least one in there. Okay, so it's probably the worst one with the sniper rifle. Uh, no, it's a... Uh, oh, there goes Mr. Handy. Mr. Handy has exploded. We need to repair him for 2,000 caps. So he's back to full health and he's rocking through the vault again. Oh my goodness, this is chaos. Okay, so let's just click on the cap. He gets some more caps. Uh, Bottle's like, nah, I've had enough of this. There's uh, death claws running around. I am not enjoying this. I am off. I am off ski like Tchaikovsky. Okay, our quest squad are all in there. That's fine. We've only got one death claw left. So hopefully, let's go to our stats. Cause rifle, 16, 17 damage. Nice. But they've already, well, the death claw has already left the room, so it doesn't really matter. Okay, double barrel shotgun. Nice. Let's see if we can upgrade. Yeah, sniper rifle. Boom. And dead. There we go, that's what we like to see. A very quickly destroyed and killed Death Claws. Okay, again, do we have better weaponry? No, I think we've now used it all. That's fine. Okay, right. Onwards and forwards with the rest of what we were doing. And of course, we will, as I said, get on a quest. Uh, well, we'll send these guys off to a quest, and then in the following play session that's later in the episode, uh, we will actually do the quest. And we're also reaching, uh, ooh, 2,000 caps, nice. And a lunchbox. Survive five rad scorpion attacks with no casualties. We'll try that one. Might take quite a long time for us to get it, uh, but it's another lunchbox, so why not? Okay, 
So, Diane, we're going to rename you Mary Stewart. So, Mary Stewart, welcome to the vault. Glad to have you with us on this journey to 200. That's right. This series will continue until we hit maximum population. Now, our rooms are actually getting fairly full, uh, so we're probably going to need to build some additional training rooms at some point, uh, because at the moment, everyone's pretty, uh, pretty busy, and we've got somebody else coming in, so Daniel Wright... Uh, let's change this name as well and add another dweller uh, to the vault. So this time it's going to be Llama Wright. So Llama, you only gave me the first name, so you are Llama Wright. Probably nowhere near your original surname, but hey, that's what you're called in the vault. And let's clear some rocks. Now we've still got over 10,000 caps, and as I said, we do need to expand. So let's rock on over to the far right hand side and fit this room because we do need another one okay and build it double wide and collect resources my goodness uh, and then let's drag this guy down and plop him into our new fitness room okay something else we do need to do at some point is start upgrading our training rooms uh, but as you can see we've already spent quite a lot of caps now there's still festive quests here so the spirit of taking uh, cheer for the ghouls three out of four so we'll get that quest done there we go let's send our quest squad so we know who that is it's certainly not donna it's rachel jeffrey and daniel that's right these three are off on their way on a festive quest okay 12 stim packs 12 randaways uh, do we have any better weapons uh, let's go to stats the answer is uh, technically yeah the gauze rifle would be a good one 16 to 17 damage and uh, let's have a look what have we got there that's 13 so swap that over for the enhanced flamer and 12 to 15 uh, no that's probably that's probably the best way to do it for now okay that'll do and start quest so we've got some very good weaponry on our quest squad well starting to get to very good weaponry wait till you see what we get today and this time I was just like you know what I'm just going to level up everyone regardless of their endurance because I'm not going around schlepping every single person uh, with endurance wear you do get that sometimes you're just like you know what I really cannot be bothered um, <laughs> it's worth taking the patience to do it of course but let's open our lunchbox and see what we get a hunting rifle a military duct tape, nice, 100 caps, 50 water, ooh, another legendary, Gatling laser, 21 to 22 damage, oh yeah, nice, that's what I'm talking about, and of course we just sent our quest squad away, so what we do need to do is uh, maybe swap over some of these weapons, uh, so again going to stats, uh, now what we should be doing is just going to all, there we go, Gatling laser for you. Uh, that should have then moved another weapon, which we really need to change this to inventory rather than uh, stats. Because at the moment we're fiddling around with people that already have decent weapons and are already in the rooms that we're looking at. Uh, so we could give the double barreled shotgun and uh, let's have a look. You, Donna, you currently have a double barreled shotgun as well by the looks of it. Uh, that is fine. Down you go. Don't really mind. Okay, let's collect some resources. And just level these people up again. I'm in that period of, I didn't care. I didn't care. Right, we've got a hunting rifle here. Uh, so let's swap that over for the sniper rifle. There we go. So now our radio room has some very, very good weaponry uh, for any more incidents that start coming. And as I said, it's basically more guard rooms. The way to look at it is that each radio room is an additional guard room for when you've specialed out some of your dwellers. You give them super duper weaponry, you give them max special stats, dump them in the radio room uh, once they're at level 50. Uh, and that is basically your enhanced guard room. So you then have four guard rooms. So you have your initial vault entrance. Then you have three radio rooms. But let's build the Nuka-Cola bottling plant. And can we build another one? No, we can't. So we've got a tiny Nuka-Cola bottling plant. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> We've got a minuscule one because we could only afford to build one and of course for that you need people with endurance uh, So we've already got someone here. So let's drag them straight in with endurance 10 lovely stuff And the second person drag them down with endurance 5 some endurance of 15 
There we go. And that produces food and water because Nuka-Cola is considered food and water. It is both resources at the same time. That's just because there's so much sugar in it. Although I'm not entirely sure it would hydrate you, but hey, hey, hey. Right, we're at 254 out of 280. Uh, we do have, of course, Piper's outfit uh, from Fallout 4. So again, a legendary outfit that we can use at some point. We have seven, wa <laughs> we have seven Wasteland gears. Uh, let's sell some of these, shall we? We don't need seven. Uh, we could scrap all, uh, but let's just scrap one. Oh, we've got a magnifying glass, nice. And uh, let's sell another one. There we go, we've got four left. Let's sell one of these lab coats. Now we're down to four. Again, some of these you could literally just go, do you know what, just sell the whole lot or recycle the whole lot. Um, let's sell all. There we go, boom, some extra caps. Uh, radiation suits, sell all. Uh, formal wear, radar armor, wasteland medic, junior officer. We've got so much stuff. The wasteland medic is a low end outfit, so again, we'll just do a sell all, and we're making some additional space. And we've completed a quest. So there's 180 caps. Uh, not quest, objective. Quests are when you go out the vault, objectives are in the vault. Okay, collect 40 outfits, survive 5 rad scorpion attacks, and raise any special stat of 9 dwellers. Well, that'll be passed the next time we do a session, because of course we'll have 400,000 uh, dwellers that all need to be upgraded. Speaking of which, let's get to the next play session. Okay, so we've got another lunch box. Good stuff. And everything to collect, so let's get everything collected. And of course we now have that quest to go on as well. So here we go, I told you it would happen in the next play session. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, boom, done. Let's wait for it to tick over. And 275 caps, nice. Merge four pairs of rooms together is now the next objective. Uh, so again, not a difficult one. Uh, we'll be able to get half of that ticked off maybe because uh, we've got enough to expand our um, Nuka-Cola plant now by another one uh, during this play session. We have somebody else with max endurance and max agility. Uh, yeah, they're, they're max there, mate. Yeah, yeah, I said max endurance. There we go. Okay. Yeah, I don't think there's any space. Oh, yeah, maybe there is. Okay. Right, carry on. We've got somebody else on max endurance and nothing else. So we need to put them somewhere else, so let's put them there. There we go, okay, so again, this is just special stat fiddlation. Fiddlation being moving them all around and just putting them into different places. Okay, now, Nuka-Cola plant, we can expand it by another one, 3,750. Boom, we now have a two wide Nuka-Cola bottling plant. Not three wide yet, because it is a super duper expensive room. And we have two more dwellers coming in from the wasteland. We've got Gerald King and whoever the second person is. Uh, who's that? No idea. Okay, it's still that crinkly Christmas music. Okay, right. Gerald King, we're going to rename you, so this is now the third person to enter the vault today. Oh, Llama, I am putting you in twice. Hey, we added you in the previous uh, play session, and we've added you in this play session. <laughs> There's two of you now. I need to go back in, in and change your name. I clearly didn't tick you off of my list, so you get added to the vault. Not once, but twice. Okay, strength. In you go. And second random dweller, Sarah Grant. Uh, you can get dragged in and dropped anywhere. It doesn't really matter where. Uh, into our new endurance room. There we go. Now let's collect our resources. Okay, there we go. Lovely stuff. Our population is now 108. Let's do the quest. Speak to the ghoul leader. Okay, in we go. It's a fairly small uh, vault, although it's not a vault, it's a mine shaft, of course. So let's progress through and see what we find. Uh, I think, as far as I remember, this one is fairly shallow on the loot, um, but it is what it is. It's one of the festive quests needed to be done to complete the series. Here we go, a couple of ghouls. You're here, Santa didn't forget about us. We've been very good ghouls this year. Okay. Of course, he'll be here real soon. With a ho ho ho. No gifts, just a ho ho ho. Hooray! Oh, look, we've got another elf outfit. 
Fantastic. By the end of this, uh, we have quite the collection, as uh, somebody already pointed out in one of the comment sections of one of the previous episodes. Okay, in we go. We've got some more ghouls. Here, your Santa's helpers. Yeah, we think we'd do blah, blah, blah. It'd be easy to just kill you and take your things. Hmm, you can't kill us. What would Santa think? That's permanent naughty list stuff. Hmm, fine. But tell him we deserve more next year. Okay, yeah, whatever. Right, down we go to the final one, which is the boss ghoul. And we'll get everything finished off nice and dandy. There we go. Hey there, smooth skins. Name's Jim. I'm in charge. Okay, you're in charge. Fantastic. Good to know. So, what do you want for Christmas? Well, we always want guns, 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 and lots of guns. You could go with something else, but let's go with guns. I think we've got something right up your alley. Ooh, it's some kind of plasma rifle -y pistol thing. Let's have a look. It's a plasma rifle, 17 to 18 damage, nice. Okay, 16 to 17, and what about the uh, laser rifle? 12 to 15, so we uh, swap that out for the flamer, and we got a new full set of weapons, plus a spare one to put back in the vault. I uh, don't know where we're going there, but we've done everything, return to the vault, oakley doakley, and bye bye Okay, we are heading back to the vault. Let's use one Quantum Cola to get straight back, seeing as we have started to build up a bit extra. Uh, we've still got 41 left, and we've managed to collect 26 out of 40 outfits, and we have not one, but two lunch boxes. Look at all these extra quests that are here. Uh, so we did. I didn't actually do any of these, um, to be honest, um, but we have got Rescue Santa, the final one. So what we could do is literally send our guys straight back out again. Uh, so there we go, Rachel, Jeffrey, and Daniel, and add 12 stim packs, 12 randaways, and send them straight back out of the vault again. I'm sure they're going to be really pleased to not even have time for a shower. That's it guys, bye bye, off you go, see you later. Okie dokie, let's collect all of our resources, even though all of our resource bars are full. Because, of course, what it does is it does give you extra experience for the dwellers. Okay, we've got someone that needs leveling up. We haven't done that yet in this episode. So, endurance wear, and then back into the outfit that they were wearing. Okay, this chap has an advanced radiation suit, so we just level him straight up. Oh, and again, wasteland gear, and level up. And put him back into the outfit he was wearing, uh, which was that one there. There we go. And again, do a bit of leveling up, and we've got a few minutes left of this episode. Uh, about four or five minutes left, I do believe, and uh, we will be at the end of episode 38. Uh, talking like this, of course, while uh, we're in the background doing leveling up, because you do know what to do. So me saying it 400 million times is not entirely necessary. Okay, again, once more, endurance wear. Level up, put back into outfit, rinse, repeat, forever and ever. Okay, now we do have, as I said, two lunch boxes now in supply, so that's not a bad thing. Somebody else to level up here as well, so again, endurance wear, level up, and put back into the outfit. Rinse, repeat, forever. Shirley Clark. Okay, let's call you. Mary Stewart. I think we may have you in the vault multiple times now as well, but welcome to the vault, Mary. Okay, 100 caps. And a chemistry flask. And an elf outfit. And some food. And another legendary item, an amplified laser pistol. Nice. Okay, on to the next lunchbox. Some water. Another legendary item, a giddy up buttercup. Some caps. A rusty hunting rifle. And a nobility outfit. Okay, not too bad. Not too bad at all. And we are at 28 out of 40 outfits collected as well because of that lunchbox. Now, paying attention there, what we should really have been doing is changing this person's weapon because they're using a pop-pop pistol. But hey, let's just move on and forget that they're using one of the worst weapons in the game. 
Okay, again, endurance level three, so we can just get you leveled up. Now, I guarantee you it's going to do the wrong person. Yep, there we go. I knew it would happen. Okay, let's go. Endurance wear, level up and flick back. Okay. Oh my goodness gracious me, it's another level up job. It's that job. Oh, mysterious stranger has appeared in your vault. Can you find him before he disappears? He's just there in the coda plant. Grab him. 495 caps. Nice. Does it give us enough? No, it does not. For some reason, it's now four and a half thousand for a Nuka Cola bottling plant. I could have sworn the previous one was cheaper. That nah, was the same price. Okay, you, madam, let's get you leveled up and get to the end of this episode. Hopefully, with not any more leveling up. Okay, officer fatigue, strength plus five. There we go. Nice. And I think let's get you into some better military attire. Some military fatigues. There we go. Improve the productivity of the room. Okay, collect some food. Anything else worth doing? Yeah, we got more resources to collect and another level up to do. But at the end of the day, it has been a very busy episode. I do hope you've enjoyed. Uh, we do still have a couple of minutes of footage before this episode finishes, but I'd just like to thank everyone who is uh, tuning in to these episodes, and thank you for also the fact I've reached 10,000 subscribers. That is my first big YouTube milestone, so thank you very much to all of you who are subscribed to the channel. It's greatly appreciated. Okay, we've got quite a few hours until they are going to reach their destination, and uh, 7 hours 55 minutes, and there are the other festive quests, but again, I will not be doing them, and uh, within the next couple of episodes, I do believe it is, uh, we will be back onto normal vault time, uh, all of the festive stuff will be gone, and we will be just doing normal episodes again. And of course, all the Christmas decorations will disappear as well. Uh, so here we have the combat shotgun, but we've got that amplified laser pistol, but it's 12 uh, laser rifle even. It's 12 to 16 damage. Uh, we ain't gonna get better than that Gatling laser. 9 to 13, focused laser rifle, yes. Okay, you with your 10 to 11, let's give you the rusty combat shotgun. There we go. Nice. Hmm. Double barreled. For you. For you. Sniper rifle. Okay, so we're basically what we're doing now is leveling up all of the guns uh, in the upper rooms. So uh, anything that's doing higher damage output than currently equipped, we will equip. And what that will do is it will mean when we have death claws, as an example, they do die a lot quicker. Uh, so for damage, you can have an enhanced sawn off shotgun. Okay, let's collect our resources in this episode. And all it leaves me to say is good morning, good afternoon, good evening. And of course, from me, Know It All Gaming, good night. And if you're not currently subscri subscribed, please hit that subscribe button, turn on the notification bell and smash that like button. Till next time, see you then.